What's up gamers? Thank you for taking the moment to check out my Madden video. Today we will be having some official Madden 20 gameplay. Shout out to Jemias. I got this clip off of his channel and I just slowed it down and I made pieces together so you guys can see it and we can go over it together. So the first thing we're going to look at is abilities. Patrick Mahomes can have what you call bazooka ability. So you can see underneath his feet it is highlighted. He motions a guy over. As soon as he hikes the ball, I want you to pay attention real fast. One safety is going to stay up top. One safety is going to drop all the way down. That is a cover three shell. Now you can see as far as the uh, defensive line, he has a very good pocket able to step up in the pocket although the defensive side has Joey Bosa and he is activated to be able to get that one-on-one -on -one block shed also you can see the wide receiver when they were running down the field they were stride for stride and then later on in that same play he gets about an eight to nine yard separation so when you watch these clips and you plan on playing Madden keep these things in the back of your head now right here you can see his escape artist ability now Joey Bosa is blinking underneath him so it looks like he is activated but Patrick Mahomes ability wins in that battle he was able to use the escape artist ability redirect itself like Michael Vick used to do back in the days and get away now right here he rolls out, throws it on the run, and past Madden's, one of them AIs would have jumped up Incredible Hulk style and snatched that out the air. I didn't see that right there. Although the scramble and throw is kind of iffy every single time he completes the ball when he scrambles and throw, it's kind of iffy. Now right there, we see the same animation that we were seeing last year out of bounds. Instead of him stiff arming, and trying to fight for an extra couple inches or just being smart and running straight out of bounds like they do in Sunday's games. He just gets bumped in the shoulders and then tiptoes. Now right here, Patrick Mahomes throws a laser beam. That's what a lot of people on Madden 19 would have called a dot. But if you break the play down, you will see it is predetermined. The guy in coverage in front of him starts backpedaling right before he releases the ball the safety is not playing aggressive like they would do in the NFL and that right there is a wide open shot whether you hit his legs whether you hit his shoulders whether you try to knock his head off that should never be a completion now it is RK mode but everybody knows who have played Madden for at least two months that RK mode sim mode competitive mode if you see the BS in one mode you are gonna see the BS in other modes especially after a patch now right here we are going over the run pass options this is something that they just put into the game for the first time in Madden 20 where you have the option to either hand the ball off and if they commit to the run you can see the screen is wide open and they have about 200 to 250 different variations of this and right here at the end of the video they are showing the Philly special now hopefully they will have a fake and then another play to add on to this otherwise that motion is going to completely give this play away although it will be fun to use against somebody who's never played Madden before or against the computer they have to have more options. So you let me know in the comment section, what do you think about the Madden 20 gameplay so far? I give it about a 5 out of 10, only because I know when I have the controller in my hand, how the game is going to play out. I can see that it's going to be an opportunity to be able to send a lot of blitzes, like the 5-2, the 3-3-5, setting up the 3-4 odd early on in the game. So stay tuned to this channel if you're going to want the nastiest and the best blitzes in Madden.